So I found something pretty special this morning. While I was splitting some wood, I'm glad I didn't hurt him. It was right under a piece of wood I was grabbing. But this is a, a rosy boa. It's a pretty unique snake. It's the most friendly snake that I've ever known. I'm not a major snake person, but these guys are pretty cool. They feel super amazing, like their skin. It feels like skin, not scales. It's super soft. This one's a young one. It's real small. Um, as far as I understand, they can live in very cold climates. They eat only a couple times a year, I believe. I'm not sure. I think this one might eat soon. I don't totally know. It's been quite a while. I found one a number of years ago. A number of years ago, before I was on dialysis. Kept it for a while. It was maybe three times, four times bigger than this. It was as big around as my finger. But it's a wild snake, and it's just as friendly as can be. I do know they um, live, they feed on baby mice. The tail here is made to look kind of like, it's supposed to look kind of like the head. So they use the tail to distract uh, predators. Actually, I think they do use it to distract the mouse while they go after the babies. But in general, it's designed to draw the attack instead of the head. Like a lot of creatures, a lot of tailed creatures. So yeah, it's just trying to get warm. I'm going to put them over here away from the house. So hopefully my cats do not find it. Because I would be really sad about that. Yeah. These guys are cool. No, you're not sure? Still holding on with your tail. Put you over just a little bit more. Should it you're by this fence? There you go. Yeah. This guy's old and doesn't really hunt, but still always a concern. Yeah, pause. What you're like 17, 18? Watch out. 